Okay, okay, okay. I'm getting my equipment set up here. Okay, all right. <laughs> all righty, righty, righty. Hold on a little bit, just a little bit more. I'm adjusting my screen here. Okay, that's perfect, I think. All right. <laughs> Hello everyone, it's me, it's Mark, and if you can see me, and if you can hear me, please say yes in the chat, and already I see a yes lolly. So that was fast. I guess um, everything's okay because you said yes. Mrs. G Classroom is in the house, and congratulations on your new school, Mrs. G. Yay, all right, all right. If you want to, you could tell everyone about it in the chat if you want to, um, or um, if you don't, that's okay. Whatever you want to do is fine, but um, feel free, Mrs. G, in the chat, you can tell everyone the great news. Anyways, all right, well, um, the, the green team is in the house. They are strong. I see Lolly, Marion, Tomas, Mrs. G classroom, Peter, Hajar, Tomas, Marion, Simon. All right, all right, all right. Good to see the green team. I also see Helga, Popcorn, Alice, yes, Samuel. All right, and um, some of your names are very, very difficult for me to, to say. I'm very sorry if I don't say your name. That is because I'm not sure how to say it. Roger, all right, Roger, that, no problem. Online game, morning, morning. Okay, all right, all right. I'm happy to see you all here. Yes. Oh, Parthi in California. Hello. All right, all right. I miss California. <laughs> all right. Well, um, let's go ahead. Oh, Lee, how you doing, Lee? How you doing, buddy? Let's go ahead and have our toast for good luck, right? We always do that. We always start our lesson, our class with a toast for good luck. And our first toast will be, of course, to the green team, the members. They make it happen. They support me. They support the channel. By supporting me and the channel, they are supporting everyone. All right, so let's give the green team a big thank you. All right, cheers, green team. If you don't have a beverage, you can fist bump. Bump, cheers, bump, cheers, yes. And because we had a toast, we have to have a drink, don't we? Yes, we do. All right. So here's my drink. How about you? <laughs> mm. All right. Now for our second toast. Yes, our second toast is to you. You are here. Without you, there's no reason for me to be here. No, no, no. Without you, there's no reason for me to be here. So um, thank you so much. So let's toast to you. Let's toast to a fun interesting productive and informative lesson today cheers everyone bump cheers bump cheers okay and because we had a toast we have to have a drink yes we do mm. all righty all right okay now for today's lesson plan it is written right here on my paper on my sheet of paper we are going to do today what is it? Yeah, you know what is it? I have four cards. I'm going to show you the picture and you're going to tell me what it is. Yes. Then we will do a conversation from my book, 50 Very Short Conversations. Today is conversation number 18 right here. And the topic is giving advice. So we're going to talk about that. We're going to practice the conversation. We will practice the conver well, we will practice the conversation, we will role play the conversation, and we will talk about its meaning. All right. So we're gonna do that. And then after that, we're going to do um, dictation cards. Yes, of course, dictation cards. I have them right here. We're gonna do dictation cards, and then after dictation cards, we will do a um, quiz and expansion question. So in the book, we have quiz and extension questions, so we'll do a little of those. 
All right. And um, all right. So <clears throat> that's what we're going to do. We're always busy. Um, and I hope you're comfortable. Today we're going to be here um, for about an hour. <laughs> we always run overtime, but on Wednesdays we're here for around an hour. Never under an hour, usually over an hour. So I hope you're comfortable. I hope you are feeling good. I hope you are happy. I hope you have a smile um, because um, let's practice together. <laughs> let's be happy together. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Hajar. Hey, Hajar. How are you doing? Okay. Okay. Um, well, let's get right to it, shall we? Oh, Sewu's in the house. How are you doing, Sewu? Good to see Sewu. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Here we go. Let's get right to it. What is it? What is it? And of course, for singular nouns, we go it's a, right? That's the reply. It's a. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, let's see, I think we just have, I think they're all singular nouns. Yes, they are. They're all singular nouns. So this is our pattern today. What is it? It's a. Now we have four cards. <coughs> we have four cards. One, two, three, and four. So I need to get four magnets because we have four cards. So the magnets are right here on the side of the whiteboard or out of the, the magnets are out of the frame, right? You don't want to see all the magnets over there. No, you don't. So they're out of frame. Okay, we have one, we have two, we have three. We have four magnets. Yes, we do because we have four cards. And here we go. Card number one. What is it? Here we go. What is it? It's coming down. Card's coming down right now. It's coming down slowly. It's coming down. And what is it? Please, in the chat, tell me what it is. Air Lady. <coughs> How you doing, Air Lady? Mwah. That's a kiss for you, Air Lady. Welcome, welcome. Okay, Helga's on the board. Helga's on the board. Helga's always very quick. Helga is very fast. She is always quick to the draw. Air Lady. Well, um, usually we say good night when we go to bed, Air Lady. So, so even though it's it's dark, we say good evening, right? So like. For example, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. When you say good night, we, we say that when we go to sleep, okay? So, Air Lady, you should say good evening from Michigan, okay? So, Air Lady, say good evening from Michigan. Okay, what is it? Okay, popcorn's on the board. Marion's there. Mrs. G's on the board. Okay, good, good, good. Yes, Air Lady, good. Good evening. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of funny, right? Because you would think, okay, we have good morning, right? That's in the morning, right? And then good afternoon, right? That's, that's in the afternoon, of course. And then logically, it makes sense when it's dark, when it's nighttime, we would say good night. But we don't do that. I don't understand why. I don't know why, but... Good night is when we go to bed, when we go to sleep. We say, oh, good night, everyone, and then you go to sleep. When, when you want to greet someone it, at night, we say good evening. It's, it's strange, I know, it's strange. Perfect, Air Lady. Good evening from Michigan. That's perfect. Okay, yes, you guys got it. It's a peacock. Well done, well done. So card number one was a peacock. What is it? It's a peacock. Yes. Okay, here we go. Card number two. What is it? Okay, the card's coming down. It's coming down, down, down. It's coming down. What is it? Is this a challenge for you? <laughs> is this... Oh! Farah is in Minnesota. Good evening from Minnesota. 
Oh, Lutz is in the house. Okay, good, good. Good to see Lutz. Okay, what is it? Okay, Lolly's on the board, Helga. Oh, good morning from Vietnam. Fantastic. Okay. I guess. Okay, for Tomas, it's morning. Good morning. <laughs> Tomas, it's early morning. Good early morning. <laughs> Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yes. Not a problem, is it? Not, no sweat. No sweat. Good evening from Colombia. Buenas noches. <laughs> is that right? Is that right? Buenos dias is more, good morning. Buenas noches, that's good evening. Maybe. <laughs> good evening. Yes, it's a butterfly. Very good. No problem. Okay. What is it? It's a butterfly. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, here we go. Card number three. Card number three. Oh, good. Buenas noches. Thank you, Hernando. Okay, here we go. Card number three. Oh, it could be a moth. <laughs> Mothra. You know, the, the Japanese um, monsters, right? So you, there's the Japanese have the famous monsters, right? Godzilla. Um, let's see. We have Mothra, right? That's a giant moth. We also have, um, oh, what's another? The turtle. I forgot the turtle name, right? So the flying turtle. That's a Japanese monster. Um, oh, I'm forgetting the turtle's name but of course we have Godzilla and Mothra and I forgot the turtle's name oh how can I forget I'm forgetting the turtle's name okay um, oh thank you Hernando good I'm happy about that Buenas noches okay and what is it number three number three Gamera, that's it. The, 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 the turtle, the monster turtle is Gamera. Gamera. Okay, what is it? Card number three, card number three. What is it? Okay, Helga, of course. Helga's always quick on the draw. Always quick on the draw. Mrs. G. <laughs> What? What? This is a dress? Strange looking dress. Okay, what is it? All right. I see a little different answers there. There are some. There are some. Okay, we have flask. A little different shape. Lolly, and it's not a flask. A flask is kind of um, thin, and it's it's for alcohol, and it's made to like fit in your pocket, right? Oh, I got I need a little drink. <laughs> that's that's strange, right? So like um, people who smoke tobacco, they they keep their their cigarettes right in their pocket, and then. <laughs> People who want whiskey, right? You never know when you want some whiskey or if you want some tequila. So you, you keep um, your alcohol in a flask and it fits in your pocket. You're walking around. Oh, this is a good time to have um, a sip of whiskey. And so you have a little sip of whiskey. <laughs> okay. Um, no, Tomas. Okay, we have... Okay, good. It's... We... we Everyone, peacock, butterfly, that was very quick. Everyone had that. But, but now this is, we have a little bit of a debate here. It, it's not a, a bomb, so it's not obvious for everyone. Okay, good, good, good. Tumblr, okay, so we got some variety of answers. I'm always happy to see that. Okay, and the actually, actually what this is, it's a water bottle. Yeah, it's a water bottle. And right, and so this like this has a nipple, and so you, you kind of pop pop it and you can like squeeze the water out of it. Like 
it's like a bottle. Well, it's like a baby bottle, right? But it's a, a water bottle. A tumbler, this is a tumbler, right? And so this is for um, hot beverages, right? So this is made of aluminum. And the water bottle is made of plastic. And um, it's made of plastic and it's made for like water, right? Where we have uh, other things, we have like a thermos that's made for like um, hot soup hot coffee, thermos, hot, hot things, hot drinks. Uh, we have a tumbler like this is. We also have, like Lolly said, a flask that's made for alcohol. And then we have a canteen and that's for, made for um, like hiking and we keep water in that. And there's a Boda bag. A Boda bag is made of, of animal skin and usually we use that, we put alcohol in that, and we use it when we go skiing <laughs> in the snow. A Boda bag. I don't know, who knows what a Boda bag is? Okay, good. Okay, a water bottle, very good. Okay, let's go to card number four, shall we? Here we go, card, okay, number four, and what is it? Here we go, coming down, card coming down. The card is coming down, what is it? What is it? Who? It's not so obvious, maybe. It's not. Hey, friends in the house. Ava's in the house. How you doing, Ava? How you doing, friend? Okay, what is it? Helga is very quick. Y yeah, so let's, it does. And it, it's actually like a baby bottle, actually. You suck from it. <laughs> like a baby sucks milk from a baby bottle. Um, people suck water from the water bottle. Okay, oh, Miss, a martini. Not cup, glass, Mrs. G. Martini glass, okay. Wine glass, Air Lady says. Champagne glass, Thomas says. Ava says cocktail glass. We have a wine glass. Okay, we have variety of answers here. I like that. Champagne glass, ice cocktail glass. Okay, I like, I like having different answers. I mean, it, it's good because what's happening even though it may be not the right answer, but lots of vocabulary. So we're all like, um, everyone reading the chat is learning new words maybe, right? So, so even though maybe it's not the right answer, it, it's good vocabulary, right? So we have martini glass. So those are for martinis, right? We have champagne glass. So, so everyone's learning like the um, vocabulary, champagne, martini, wine, right? And so cocktail. So we're, we're learning um, lots of vocabulary, maybe new words for some people, or maybe review for other people. So this is great. This is great. Okay. And the answer is, -na 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 -na. the answer is cocktail glass. Now, cocktail is, is a group of drinks right? So we have martini. That's a, a, a special drink, right? Made with vodka. So that's a martini. So we could put a martini, martini in this. Champagne, right? That's a specific drink. We could put um, champagne in there. Um, wine is a specific drink. So we could put wine in there. But cocktail. Well, champagne is not a cocktail. A cocktail is a mixed drink where champagne is champagne wine is wine but a martini is a mixed drink right and so so martini different ingredients make a martini and so uh, a cocktail are there many many different kinds of cocktails and cocktails are a mixture of drinks so we just call this a margarita i love margaritas they're my favorite that's my favorite um cocktail is a margarita that is my favorite cocktail, margarita. Yes, yes. 
Okay, so um, a cocktail glass. All right, good job, everyone. Good, 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 good. Okay, let's review. All right, let's review. What is it? It's a peacock. What is it? It's a peacock. What is it? It's a butterfly. What is it? It's a butterfly. What is it? It's a water bottle. What is it? It's a water bottle. What is it? It's a cocktail glass. What is it? It's a cocktail glass. Okay, good, 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 good. Well, um, well done. That was like a warm up. And um, oh, Mrs. G makes delicious margaritas. Uh, don't. I don't want to hear about that. No, 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 no. <laughs> No, because I will be thirsty for a margarita. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Actually, I like my margaritas blended. Yeah, so you could have a margarita on ice or blended. And I like my margaritas blended. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, I'm going to take a picture of the whiteboard because our next activity is the conversation. Okay, so... Um, I'm going to go ahead and take a picture of the whiteboard so you can check it out anytime you want to. And of course, all my whiteboards go, <clears throat> I upload to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice. So go to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, to see all the whiteboards. Okay, so there's the cameras open. I'm going to take a picture. Okay, here we go. Let's count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, there is the picture. I got it. Now I'm going to erase because we're going to practice the conversation. Oh, it's still cold here in Japan. It's still cold. When is it going to warm up? Oh, gosh. This always happens, like, um, like here in Japan, the summers are super hot, right? And so, come on winter, right? And so, like, oh, I want winter to come, right? And then winter comes, and I, at the beginning, I'm happy, right? Woo, it's cooled down, and then, oh, I can wear my hat and gloves, and so it's kind of, it's fun. But then, around this time of the year, right, end of February, beginning of March, it's like, okay, it's still cold. I'm ready for warm weather. <laughs> When's the warm weather coming? I'm ready because I've been cold for a long time. I'm getting sick of the cold. <sighs> okay, let's get some warm water or some warm weather. Come on, come on, weather. I'm ready. I'm ready to. I'm ready to put away my turtlenecks. No more turtlenecks. I'm ready to put away the long sleeve shirts. No more long sleeve shirts. I'm ready for short sleeves. Yes, I'm ready for warm weather. <laughs> okay, here we go. Do exercise, you will feel warm. That's right. That's um, um, uh, Ray, Rayleigh. Rayleigh. Okay. Yes, Let's, you're right. <laughs> when it's hot, we're ready for cold. And then when it's cold, we're ready for warm. Yep, exactly. <laughs> okay. <coughs> oh, boy, my, my allergies. Okay, here we go. Today's conversation. Are you, I'm going, okay, we're going to do a few steps. Always, we always do a few steps. Um, first, I'm going to read the conversation, all right? So just listen. I'm not going to show you the conversation. Just listen. Then I'm going to write the conversation on the whiteboard, okay? Then we will practice together. We will um, practice fluency. We will talk about the meaning. Then we will role play, okay? So, but step one here, let's um, listen, okay? So just listen to me. Here we go. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. I've been super tired lately. You should take vitamins. How will vitamins help? They will give you important minerals. Which ones 
should I take? Start with B12. Okay, here we go, one more time. I've been super tired lately. You should take vitamins. How will vitamins help? They will give you important minerals. Which ones should I take? Start with B12. Okay, we always do things in three, right? Three is a charm, so I'm going to read it for the third time. Here we go. I've been super tired lately. You should take vitamins. How will vitamins help? They will give you important minerals. Which ones should I take? Start with B12. Okay, good, good. All right, so that was the conversation. I'm going to show you the picture. Okay, so this, guy, this guy's been tired, and um, his friend is giving him advice about taking vitamins, right? And so we have, like, the beginning of the conversation, then, and then it continues down here, and then extension, right? Okay, so let's go ahead. I, I will write the conversation on the board so we can practice together. Okay, so <clears throat> A says, here's A, A says, I've been super tired lately. I've been, my cap is going to come off. Okay, I've been super tired lately. Okay, I've been super tired lately. Then B says, you should take vitamins. You should take vitamins. Then A says, how will vitamins help? How will vitamins help? How will they help? How, how will they help? How will vitamins help? B says, they will give you important minerals. They will give you important Minerals. Then A says, which ones should I take? Which ones? Which ones should I take? And then B says, Start with, start with B12. Okay, start with B12. Okay, good, good, good. So here's our conversation. And I know today's going to be a big debate because about minerals and vitamins and things like that. So that's, that's cool, right? So we're going to, I'm sure many of you have opinions about vitamins. Yes, I'm sure you do. It's, it's always a, a hot topic, right? Vitamins are always a hot topic, right? People have an opinion, and the opinions um, vary, and um, some people are like, yeah, I got to take lots of vitamins, and some people say, no, don't take any vitamins, and some people um, are in the middle, right? So this is good, all right? So let's um, practice the conversation by um, with fluency so we'll, we'll, we'll practice speed we'll go slowly and quickly and we'll go over pronunciation okay and then we will talk about the meaning and then we will role play okay and then we will talk more about vitamins okay here we go okay let's practice speed let's go slowly and quickly here we go I've been super tired lately. I've been super tired lately. 
I've been super tired lately. I've been super tired lately. I've been super tired lately. I've been super tired lately. I've been super tired lately. You should take vitamins. 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 How will vitamins help? 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 They will give you important minerals. 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 Which ones should I take? 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 Start with B12. Start with B12. Start with B12. Start with B12. Okay, good, good. All right. So we did a little pronunciation and speed practice. Yes. Now let's talk about the meaning. All right. So I've been. So I've is I have, right? That's a contraction. I have, or we could say, so when you're writing like a paper or a letter, you should write I have. But when we speak, we, we, we blend the two words together and we say I've. So I've been super tired lately. Now, tired, right? So that's when you're, you're um, working too much or you don't have energy, right? So when you're tired, you do not have energy. So here, super, so that's, we're using that as, like we're being, um, we're describing how tired we are by like, okay, I'm pretty tired. Then if you're like, I'm super tired, meaning, extremely like I have no energy at all no energy at all none zero I've been super tired lately right so these days lately these days so I have had no energy these days so that's another we can say I've been super tired lately or we could say I have had no energy these days I have had no energy these days. You should take vitamins. So giving advice, right? So um, A, A has no energy these days. And so B, you should take vitamins. Vitamins will give you energy, right? So you should, you should. My advice to you is to take vitamins. How will vitamins help? How? So this question like, um, please explain the benefits of vitamins. How? Explain the benefits. Explain the good points. Explain the positives. How will vitamins help? So help me because I'm tired. How will they help my tiredness? How will vitamins help my tiredness. They will give you important minerals. They will give you important minerals. Now they, right? That's a pronoun for, for vitamins. They, right? So we don't have to keep saying vitamins, 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 vitamins. We can just say um, they, ones, right? Which ones? So here we say, I'm super tired. Um, you should take vitamins. How will vitamins help? So now we, we, we have established what we're talking about, right? So we're talking about vitamins. So we don't have to keep saying vitamins. So now we could refer to vitamins with um, they and one, okay? So um, they, vitamins, they will give you important minerals. So minerals are, um, minerals actually help our, well, Important for our blood, muscles, um, 
Minerals help our muscles, our blood, oxygen, um, our nerves. So like basically they keep our body functioning normally. Okay, so, so minerals will keep our body working normally. <laughs> okay, so we'll talk more about minerals, all right? So um, which ones should I take? So, okay, here, minerals. So we're talking about minerals now, ones. Okay, so, okay, here, okay, so let's, I'm sorry, let's go back here a sec. Okay, um, okay, I've been super tired. You should take vitamins. So, okay, now we're talking about vitamins here. How will vitamins help? And then they refers to vitamins. And then um, here, minerals. So the next sentence, which ones? And so we're talking about minerals now. So which ones should I take? So ones here equals minerals. So which minerals should I take? And then um, B says start with B12. So that's beta carotene 12. And so, so that's um, good for our body and good for our energy yeah okay so um, start with B12 so advice so a lot of times when we when we give advice we say like okay start with this so for example oh I want to lose weight okay start by exercising oh I um, I'm feeling tired okay start by sleeping longer or start with going to bed earlier so if we're giving advice how to give advice and so a good way is like start this way so um so, so little by little right so if you want to lose weight okay start by walking right and so that's easy and that's a good start so when you're giving advice it's good to use start right and, and start with this once you start doing that, then we can, it can get more difficult, right? So maybe people say, oh, how should I, or how can I learn English? How can I learn English? Oh, start by watching YouTube, right? And then maybe um, go to school or buy a textbook, right? So how should I start? Oh, start by watching YouTube, right? So that's a first step. So start, that is the first step. Okay, good, 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 good. All right, now um, let's role play, shall we? Let's, let's start. Let's see, oh, okay, Hajar, I'm sorry. Now, I, I've been looking at the, at the camera, so I haven't been looking at the chat, but I see now, Hajar, um, I don't like taking vitamins. I don't know why, but I think my grandpa always told me don't take any vitamins eat healthy and exercise is your medicine I miss him so much um, Hajar that is um, great advice and I think that's true as well so vitamins and minerals are just naturally in food so if you're eating healthy and you're eating the right food you don't need vitamins I feel I think I think the same way as you Hajar I, I, I agree with you okay Ava, yeah, start with exercise. So actually, that's good advice, right? So if someone's tired, then, you know, exercise will actually help you, right? It's like, ah, I'm always tired. Well, start by walking, and I think um, that will help you, right? Okay, good, 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 good. All right, so um, let's role play, right? That is, let's, um, let's practice the conversation together, okay? So let's, let's be the conversation. Let's Let's be the conversation. I will be A, you will be B, okay? A, B, A, B, okay? So let's do it, yeah? Okay, so I will say A, you will say B. Okay, here we go, count down. Five, four, three, two, one. I've been super tired lately. How will vitamins help? Which ones should I take? Thank you very much. Good advice. <laughs> okay, let, let's do it again. Okay, let's count down. Five, four, three, two, one. I've been super tired lately. How will vitamins help?
Which ones should I take? Thank you for your wonderful advice. <laughs> okay, third's a charm, yeah? The third time is a charm. So let's do it again. A, B, A, B, countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. I've been super tired lately. How will vitamins help? Which one should I take? Thank you very much. I will go. I will take vitamin B12. I'm, in fact, I'm going to the store right now to buy vitamin B12. Bye bye. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's switch. All right, so you are A, I'm B. A, B, A, B. Let's count down. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. You should take vitamins. They will give you important minerals. Start with B12. <laughs> okay, let's do it again. Number two, count down. Five, four, three, two, one, go. You're eight. You should take vitamins. They will give you important minerals. Hmm, hmm, start with B12. <laughs> okay, good. Okay, here's the third time. Yes, count down. Five, four, three, two, one, go. You should take vitamins. They will give you important minerals. Hmm, let me think. Oh, you should, st or start with B12. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well done. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. That was the conversation. Actually, we will come back to the conversation. Okay. But right now let's do our dictation cards. Okay. So we, we will do our dictation cards. <coughs> then we will come back to the conversation and um, talk about minerals. Okay. Today we're going to talk about minerals. All right. So, um, Anyways, let's do our dictation cards. And you need pencil. Oh, I have a pencil right here. You need a pencil and paper. Yes, you do, because you're going to listen and write down what I say word for word. And we're going to do four, <coughs> four steps. Four steps, I'm gonna write down the four steps. You know the, you know the four steps, yes, you do. We're going to do dictation. We're going to do shadowing and meaning. You're going to do it on your own. And we will have a quiz. Yes. All right. So those are our four steps. So let's get right to it. Oh, and the topic is how to give advice. How to. How to give advice. So that's our, our, our topic is how to give advice. How to give advice. All right, so that's our topic, how to give advice. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards. Of course, eight cards. Here we Go. Okay, Ava's ready. Lolly's ready. Pencil and paper. B12, I should have taken it. So tired. Oh, say woo, say woo. Yes, get vitamin B12. <laughs> vitamin B6. Yeah, so the, the B's are all good, right? All those B's are good. Oh. Let's, you missed, we practiced the conversation. That's what you missed. Okay, Lolly, I stopped. Now we are going to do dictation cards, okay? So you need, okay, let's, you need a pencil and paper, and I want you to write down what I say word for word. Here we go. Popcorn is ready. Here we go. And our topic, how to give advice, how to. Here we go, card number one. Countdown, five, four, three, two, one. I would advise you 
to get more exercise. Two. I would advise you to get more exercise. Okay, third time. I would advise you to get more exercise. Hair loss? Hair loss? What's hair loss? <laughs> Card number two, card number two. In my experience, coffee works well. In my experience, coffee works well. In my experience, coffee works well. Okay, card number three. It's a good idea to grow plants. It's a good idea to grow plants. It's a good idea to grow plants. Okay, four. One idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. Okay, card number five. You ought to take up painting. You ought to take up painting. You ought to take up painting. Number six. Have you tried listening to music? Have you tried listening to music? Have you tried listening to music? Okay, here we go. Number seven, number seven. <clears throat> if I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. Last card, last card, number eight. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. <laughs> uh. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. <laughs> a beer or two. <laughs> One or two. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was dictation. I hope you wrote everything I said. We'll check. Yeah, we'll check by um, doing our next step. Yeah. Okay, so we did our dictation practice. Now it's time for shadowing and then talking about the meaning. All right, here we go. Okay, shadow. So now, <laughs> I bet, I knew, Lolly, when I wrote this, I was thinking about you, Lolly. Yes, when I was, um, yesterday, I made the dictation cards and I was thinking about Lolly. I go, oh yeah, she'll agree with me. <laughs> I knew I, when I was writing, I got, I bet, Lolly will agree with this sentence. <laughs> okay, shadowing time. Now it's speaking time. Yeah, not writing time. It is speaking time. Yes, it is. Here we go. Countdown to shadowing. Five, four, three, two, one. I would advise you to get more exercise. 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 Now, so how to give advice, right? So here's a, a strategy. So I would advise you, all right? So I would advise you, all right? And then what is it? Then what is your advice, right? So start with 
I would advise you to blah, blah, blah. Okay, so here, for example, I would advise you to get more exercise. Card two. In my experience, coffee works well. In my experience, coffee works well. In my experience, coffee works well. <clears throat> In my experience, coffee works well. Okay, so another way how to give advice by saying, in my experience, blah, blah, blah. Right, so if someone asks you for advice, you, you should say, in my experience, blah, blah, blah. All right, so in my experience, coffee works well. Three, <clears throat> it's a good idea to grow plants. 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 Okay, how to give advice? Start with saying, it's a good idea to blah, blah, blah. It's a good idea to blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Card four. One idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. <clears throat> One idea is to stretch. All right, so how to give advice? So you might say, oh, one idea is to blah, blah, blah. One idea is to blah, blah, blah. One idea is to blah, blah, blah. Five, <clears throat> you ought to take up painting. 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 All right, so how to give advice? This is a start with saying, you ought to blah, blah, blah. You ought to blah, blah, blah. You ought to blah, blah, blah. Okay, card number six. Have you tried listening to music? 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 All right, how to give advice? Start with, have you tried blah, blah, blah? Have you tried blah, blah, blah? Have you tried blah, blah, blah? <laughs> okay, number seven. If I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I would take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. Okay, so how to give advice? So another way, if I were you, I'd blah, blah, blah. If I were you, I'd blah, blah, blah. If I were you, I'd blah, blah, blah. <laughs> okay, here we go, number eight, last card. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. <laughs> All right. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. Now, how to give advice? So start with, oh, the best thing to do is blah, blah, blah. The best thing to do is blah, blah, blah. The best thing to do is blah, blah, blah. <laughs> okay. All right, all right, yes, 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 well done. We did shadowing and meaning, yes we did, woohoo. All right, all right, now our third step is on your own, yes, you will do it on your own. I have, <coughs> I have a card right here. We will take turns. Now, step one and two, we did it together, but now we're going to take turns. I will say it, then you will say it. I will say it, then you will say it. When you say it, I'm going to cover the card. You will not see the sentence. You will say the sentence only by looking at the picture, okay? It's a challenge, but that's why you are here. Okay, here we go. Mrs. G, classroom. You made a great entrance. I haven't seen you for a long time, and Mrs. G, you are wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Mwah. 
Wonderful. Mrs. G, always kind to me. Right there, on the wall of love. This is, this is the wall of love. So, Mrs. G, you made the wall of love. <laughs> this is the wall of love. Thank you so much. Okay, let's do it on your own. You're going to do it by yourself. Okay, oh, I'm going to go first, then you will go. We take turns. Yes, we do. Okay, here we go. I'm going to go first, then you go. I would advise you to get more exercise. Now it's your turn. I would advise you to get more exercise. I would advise you to get more exercise. I would advise you to get more exercise. In my experience, coffee works well. Uh, hold on. Wait, wait, Lolly. Uh-oh. Let me check. <laughs> oh, no. Maybe I made a mistake, Lolly. Hold on. Okay. In my experience, coffee works well. 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 Oh, did I make? I would advise. Hold on, that's a good, good. Hold on, hold on. I need to. Uh huh. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, Lolly. Oh, okay, everyone. Maybe Mark made a mistake. Let's check. Yeah. Mark made a mistake. I'm full of mistakes. Yeah, yeah. That's right. Okay. Sorry. Um, so I wrote here advice. It should be advice. This should be a S, not a C. My mistake. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I hate making mistakes. I did it. I always do it. Okay, so advise. Oh, God. Ah. So we're, this is a verb, right? Advise. It should be a verb. Okay. And then um, advice. Noun. So this is a verb. This is a noun. So advise, advice. So I would advise. So that should be an S, not a C. I'm so sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Lolly. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, because we don't want to give people bad information, right? I don't want to give people bad information. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so embarrassing, right? It's embarrassing for me. But, oh, well. Okay, here we go. <laughs> let's continue. All right, here. Let's continue. Here we go. Okay, it's a good idea to grow plants. Now it's your turn. It's a good idea to grow plants. It's a good idea to grow plants. It's a good idea to grow plants. Oh no, we got street construction happening right now. Ah! I hope it's not noisy for you. Out, outside, they're doing construction, street construction. Thank you. Nagesh, Nagesh, thank you very much. Thank you for that. <laughs> it 
Thank, yeah, yes. So, Mrs. G, we learn from mistakes. Yes. So, um, actually, <laughs> that was on purpose. Yes. So, I made that mistake on purpose because I wanted this to be a teachable moment. Yes. So, advise is the verb. Advice is the noun. So, I did that on purpose. Not really. I'm, I actually made the mistake. But I can say, I did that on purpose for a teachable moment. Yes, this is a teachable moment right here. Advise, advice. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Um, one idea is to stretch. That's right, let's. It's a teachable moment. One idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. Hey, Dr. Ramirez is in the house. How you doing? Mwah. Thank you, Dr. Ramirez. Thank you. <laughs> or actually, popcorn should be opposite. It should be no failure, no success. Right? No failure, no success. Okay, popcorn, yep. So um, when NASA, right, the first rockets, they blew up, right? So first there was failure, then there was success. Yes, that's great, popcorn, right? Because all the great inventions, all the great things in the world, first there was failure, of course. They first tried it. Oh, no, it, it, it blew up. It didn't work. And then try again and again and again, and then it was successful. Yeah, popcorn, no failure, no success. Here we go, next card. You ought to take up painting. 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 Have you tried listening to music? Have you tried listening to music? Okay, Felipe, hold on a sec, Felipe. I'll answer. One, one second, Felipe. Have you tried listening to music? Have you tried listening to music? Okay, Felipe, um, take up meaning to um, learn. Or like, okay, take up music, like um, go to music class. Take up painting, uh, um, start painting, right? So, so um, start an activity. S um, take up meaning to begin an activity. Ought, yeah, so actually, um, Friend, ought to means should, you should. You ought to, you should. Thank you, Tomas. Thank you, Tomas. Evelyn, how you doing? Mwah, Evelyn's in the house. Okay, here we go. Card number seven. If I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. Here's our last card, last card. Oh, Felipe, no problem, no problem, Felipe. Here we go, card number eight. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. Yes, thank you, Let's. Take up, thank you, Let's. The best thing to do is have a beer or two.
The best thing to do is have a beer or two. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was, um, you did it on your own. Yeah, so you said the sentences by just looking at the picture, right? So the picture should be a cue for you or a prompt for you to um, say the sentence. Yeah, okay, good, good, good. Now it's time for our quiz. I'm going to shuffle the cards and then the top three cards you will write those sentences in the chat. Hernando or 12. <laughs> the best thing to do is, ha is have a beer or 12. <laughs> um, beer is uncountable. However, bottle of beer is countable. Two bottles, three bottles of beer. Yes. So beer is uncountable. Bottles are countable. Okay, Lolly, I, sh I stopped. And I'm going to take the first three cards from the top, and I want you to write the sentence in the chat. Okay, here we go. Write the sentence in the chat. What is the sentence? What, what is the sentence? Please write the sentence in the chat. Please write the sentence in the chat. Ava, I think Hernando was, was joking. I think Hernando was joking. <laughs> okay, what is... Hey, Patty. Patty's in the house. Mwah, how you doing, Patty? Okay, what is the sentence? Oh, Felipe. Okay, Felipe's on the board. Helga is on the board. Peter is on the board. Alice is on the board. Popcorn. Mendez, what's the sentence up here? Okay. Nice, nice, nice. Samuel. Good, good. Okay. Ah, oh, Haitis, how you doing? Okay, good. Ava, good. Okay, um, Ray Ray, Lolly, Dr. Ramirez, Lee, all right, Lee, Tomas, what is that? <laughs> it's, these are headphones and um, notes, musical notes. Okay, here we go. What is the sentence? Da -na 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 -na. Yes. Have you tried listening to music? Very good. Okay, card number two for the quiz. We are doing three cards. This is card number two. What is the sentence, please? What is the sentence? Yes, friend. Yes, Hernando. Okay, what is the sentence? So, um, Tomas, it's actually, have you tried listening to music? Have you tried listening to music? Okay, card number two. Lolly's on the board. Peter's on the board. Helga's on the board. Okay, what is the sentence? Popcorn, Mendez, let's see, let's see, let's see for ourselves, let's see for ourselves, Ray, Ray, Alice, Haitis, Mia, Mia's on the board, all right, friends on the board, Dr. Ramirez is on the board, Samuel's on the board. Tomas is on the board. Lee's on the board. Ava's on the board. Yes. Uh, Sharondep. Sharondep is on the board. Evelyn's on the board. 
Hernandez is on the, Hernando's on the board. Marion's on the board. Let's check our answers. How did you do? How did you do? In my experience, coffee works well. In my experience, in my experience, coffee works well. <laughs> All right. One more card, everyone. This is the last one. Last card. Here we go. What is the sentence, please? What is the sentence, please? Oh, okay, deep. Sorry, sorry. Sharonda deep. Sharonda deep. Sharonda deep. Actually, that's a beautiful name. Sharonda deep. Sharonda deep. Yeah, Sharonda deep. I like your name. That's a beautiful name. Sharonda deep. Sharonda deep. Sharonda Deep. Mwah, good name. Okay, what is the sentence, please? That's right, Hernando. Hernando. Hernan, Hernando. Hernando. This is Colombian coffee I'm drinking. Grown in Colombia. Coffee beans grown in Colombia. Okay, what is the sentence? Okay, Marion's on the board, Tomas is there, Mendes is there, okay, Samuel, Dr. Ramirez, Hernando, let's see, Eva, okay, let's Oh, Lolly, Lolly's there too. I missed Lolly, but now I saw Lolly. Evelyn, okay, good, good, good. All right, let's check the sentence, shall we? It's a good idea to grow plants. Yes, yes, very good, well done. Yeah, 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 okay. Well done. Now, actually, I have a good idea. I have a good idea. Now, these, all these sentences were about how to give advice. How to give advice. Oh, great, great. Oh, I, 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 can't, I can't pronounce your name, but um, in Malaysia, thank you. Mwah. Good to see you. Thank you for your kind words. There's no way I can pronounce your name without hearing it from you. So just by the spelling, I, I can't pronounce it. If you were here to tell me how to say your name, I could, but because I can't hear you, I'm so sorry, but um, I, I appreciate that. And um, I, feel very, I feel very happy that you and your students are watching my videos. Mwah, thank you so much. Okay, now we're talking about um, how to give advice. Right? So these are solutions, right? So here, someone has a problem, someone wants advice, and, and so you um, give advice, and um, right? And so we say, you know, have you tried, right? Have you tried? In my experience, in my experience, you ought to, you ought to. I would advise you to, the best thing to do is, if I were you, I'd, one idea is to, okay? So this, these, these are all how to, all these sentences are about how to give advice. Now, I want you to tell me what you think the trouble is. What's the problem, okay? So what's the problem? What's the problem? Okay, so what's, now, so we're, we're, we're working backwards, right? 
we're working backwards. So um, you tell me what the problem is by the advice. So by the advice, what's the problem? Okay, so please tell me what's the problem. Here we go. Um, okay. You, okay, the advice is you ought to take up painting. You ought to take up painting. So what is the problem? The, the, the advice is you ought to take up painting. That's the advice. What is the problem? Okay, Radu, I'm too busy. Or like, okay, yeah, okay, that's what I was looking for. Mendez, perfect. Yes. <laughs> Felipe, that, 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 that's funny. I failed my art class. <laughs> so maybe you should not take up painting. Maybe you should give it up. <laughs> don't, don't do it anymore. If you failed painting, you should not do it anymore. But okay, I like, I like uh, Mendez's um, ed, um, answer, right? So, oh, I feel stress. Or I, 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 I'm very stressful right now. I'm, I'm too I have too much stress in my life. My, my life is too stressful. Oh, you ought to take up painting. Yeah, very good. Nicely done. Okay, how about this? What is the problem? What is the problem? One idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. What is the problem? What is the problem? One idea is to stretch. What is the problem? Oh, Felipe, a lot of people have bought my paintings and they have paid tons of dollars for them. Well, Felipe, you're a successful painter. Felipe is very successful. He is a successful painter. Okay, Lolly says, I have, I have some pain in my body. So you don't need to say pains. You could just say, Lolly, I have some pain in my body. Oh, that's a good idea. Um, one idea is to stretch. Oh, Evelyn, I, want, I watch too much TV. Okay, this would be your advice. You ought to take up painting. Yeah, so Evelyn, I watch too much TV. My advice to Evelyn, you ought to take up painting. Okay, Mendez, I have a backache. Yes, my advice to you, or one idea is to stretch. I'm, I, I'm depressed. Oh, one idea is to stretch, yeah. Or, if you're depressed, Samuel, I would say um, you ought to take up painting. If you feel depressed, you ought to take up painting. I think that can help your depression, painting. Okay, good, good. Um, Tomas, the problem is with joints and... Okay, so, okay, I have joint and muscle pain. Tomas, I have joint and muscle pain. I have joint and muscle pain. My advice to you is um, to stretch. One, one idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. Oh, Felipe, oh, that's too bad. <laughs> oh, that's too bad, Felipe. I wish that was true. Okay, oh, Lolly, I have some pain in my body. Perfect. Okay, here we go. Our next. Oh, okay, okay. Dr. Maris, um, she gets hurt a lot. Okay, you have to um, change that a little bit, Dr. Maris. She gets hurt a lot when she when she exercises. She gets hurt a lot when she exercises. Yeah, good. So this is perfect advice for her. One idea is to stretch. One idea is to. So Dr. Morris, I get hurt a lot when I exercise. I get hurt a lot when I exercise. I get hurt a lot when I exercise. One idea is to stretch. One idea is to stretch. Okay, three. Here's the our next problem, or next advice, what's the problem? What's the, what's the problem? 
Have you tried listening to music? Okay, okay, Lolly, I have tight muscles. Okay, I have a tight muscle. Usually we don't say a muscle, right? Because we have many muscles, right? Many all over our body. So we would say, um, I have tight muscles. Even though, or we'd say, I have um, tight, I have tight shoulders. So you, you, you could say, you could say that, or my legs are tight. My, my back is tight. Okay. My, my neck is tight. What's the problem? Okay, have you tried listening to music? Okay, Lolly. Um, oh, I need to relax more. Okay, Lolly. I need to relax more. I need to relax more. Oh, have you tried listening to music? Problem, I need to relax more. Advice, have you tried listening to music? Have you tried listening to music? Oh no, Evelyn does not have a radio. Ah, so my advice to you, Evelyn, is go buy one. <laughs> or my advice, um, you can use your smartphone. You can use your smartphone. If you have a smartphone, you can use your smartphone to listen to music. Not a radio, use your smartphone. YouTube has lots of music. You can, YouTube has all the music. YouTube has all the music you want. Yeah, Lolly, I need to relax more. Okay, Lolly's problem, I need to relax more. My advice to Lolly is, have you tried listening to music? Have you tried listening to music? Oh, Samuel, I'm so sad. Oh, have you tried listening to music? Yeah, good, good, good. Ah, Sharonda Deep. I haven't, I haven't any problem when I try to listen to music because I love um, lesson all the genius it really helps me reduce my stress. Oh, okay, so maybe Sharonda Deep by watching um, these live streams is giving, is letting you um, relax. Good, good. I hope my videos will help you relax. <laughs> I hope they help you learn English, but if they help you relax too, right, that's a double, that's a um, kill bird, two, kill two birds with one stone, right? So we can, we can um, do two things at the same time. Learn English and relax. Learn English and relax. I hope that is the case. <laughs> okay. Oh, insomnia. Oh, no. Mendes has insomnia. Oh, I hope. Have you tried listening to music? Oh, insomnia would be good for... Um, ex exercise is good for insomnia. Okay. Here we go. Four. Card number four. Okay, uh, it's a good idea to grow plants. What's the problem? The advice, it's a good idea to grow plants. What's the problem? The advice, it's a good idea to grow plants. What's the problem? What's the problem? Oh, thank you, Sharonda Deep. Mwah. I'm happy to help. I'm happy my videos help you. That makes me feel good. Oh, Mia, if I feel alone, um, I try listening to music. Good, good, Mia. If I feel alone, I try listening to music. Good. Healthy food. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. So, so um, Helga, vegetables. So these are plants, not vegetables. So, so your problem, okay, I need to have healthy food or I need to eat healthier food. Okay, Helga, I need to eat healthier food. Then my advice, it's a good idea to grow vegetables. It's a good idea to grow vegetables. Ah, so 
This is let's see's problem. Vegetables are too expensive nowadays. Vegetables are too expensive these days. So my advice to let's see is it's a good idea to grow vegetables. <laughs> it's a good idea to grow them yourself. So let's see problem is um, oh, vegetables are too expensive these days. Oh, a good idea is to grow your own vegetables. Grow your own vegetables. Oh, Ava, I want to eat organic food. Oh, it's a good idea to grow your own food. It's a good idea to grow your own food. Okay, Sharonda Deep says, I love listening to music because I want to become a good singer. Oh, yeah. I think it's almost like singing, you have to be born with it, right? I don't know. Like, I'm terrible. I'm a terrible singer. I listen to music all the time, but I can't sing very well. That doesn't help me. Okay, so let's see has a green thumb, so that's no problem growing vegetables for, um, let's see. Lee Smith, grow your own vegetables. That's right, so Lee Smith, that's good advice, right? So um, Lee Smith, do you grow your own vegetables? In Africa, so you live in um, Uganda. So um, Lee, you live in Uganda. So um, can you grow healthy vegetables in Uganda? Okay, here we go. What is the problem? The best thing to do is have a beer or two. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. What is the problem. Oh, Sharonda Deep. Yes, singing is my life. Nice, nice. Yeah, Tomas, that's a great, great point. Tomas says, you can be proud of your own plants. That is a good feeling. That good. Yes, Tomas, that's fantastic. That is a great point. That's a good, good point. Ah, Lolly's problem is I feel lonely today and I give her advice. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. <laughs> so Lolly's problem is I feel lonely today. My advice for Lolly is the best thing to do is have a beer or two. Ah, Helga, I want to relax on Friday. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. Let's see, says, I am thirsty. My advice, the best thing to do is have a beer or two. If you are thirsty, I advise you to have a beer or two, says Tomas. Sharonda Deep, drinking beer is harmful for our health. <laughs> yes, yeah. A little bit, okay? Sometimes, Sharonda Deep. Sometimes a little bit is okay. Moderation is okay. Every day is not okay. Sometimes I think is okay. Yes, Men um, that's right, Mendes. That is true. Um, too much is the problem. Too much is the problem. Or being drunk. Being drunk is a problem for sure, for sure. Okay, Ava, I eat too much fat. So, if you eat too much fat, you sh a good idea is to grow your own. A, a good idea is to eat more vegetables. Ava, a good idea is to eat more vegetables. That's right. Oh, Lolly has great advice. Be careful and don't drive. Be careful when you're drinking alcohol. Be careful and don't drive. Good advice, Lolly. Okay, here's our next. What's the problem? In my experience, coffee works well. What is the problem? The advice is, in my experience, coffee works well. Dr. Ramirez, long time no see some... F oh, 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 oh. I haven't... Okay, I haven't seen my friends... In a long time, okay, Dr. Maris, I haven't seen my friends in a long time. The best thing to do is have a beer or two. 
when you see them. I haven't seen my friends for a long time. I haven't seen my friends for a long time. The best thing to do is have a beer or two when you see them. The best thing to do is have a beer or two when you see them. Oh, Lolly's problem. I have been tired lately. My advice to Lolly is, in my experience, coffee works well. When you're tired, coffee works well. When you're tired, coffee works well. When you're tired, coffee works well. Oh, Lolly says, I'm a bit tired. My advice to you is, in my experience, coffee works well. In my experience, coffee works well. In my experience, coffee works well. Oh, let's see. I have exams this week and I have to stay up at night and study till dawn. Okay, let's see. My, my advice to you is, in my experience, coffee works well. And that is true. <laughs> I remember when I was a university student and I had to write papers, I would um, brew a pot of coffee and, and write papers until dawn. I remember that. I remember. I remember. That is part of the university experience. That is part of being a student, right? That's the experience of a student, staying up all night, studying and writing. <laughs> okay, here we go, Card. The next advice is, I would advise you to get more exercise. What is the problem? Advice is, I would advise you, so mistake, this is a spelling mistake, it should be advise, it should be advise, it should be the verb. I would advise you, I would advise you to get more exercise. What is the problem? Helga, I'm tired but I have too much to do. This is my advice for Helga. In my experience, coffee works well. Okay, Lolly's problem. I have to lose weight. My advice to Lolly is, I would advise you to get more exercise. Oh no, Felipe has a problem. Felipe only poops once a week. Oh, my advice to you is to have, eat more fiber, eat more vegetables, eat more healthy food. <laughs> you should poop every day, Felipe. You should poop every day. <laughs> Felipe, I've gained tons of weight. Okay, that's a problem, right? So my advice to you is... Um, I would advise you to get more exercise. I would advise you to get more exercise. Oh, let's see, says, I have been putting on a lot of weight recently and my parents say I am overweight. Well, my advice to you is, um, I would advise you to get more exercise. Ah, uh, Dr. Maris says, I easily get fat. Okay, Dr. Maris, I easily get fat. I, I easily, or actually, I easily gain weight. That's better, Dr. Maris. I easily gain weight. I easily gain weight. And then my advice to you is, um, I would advise you to get more exercise. Okay. Oh, Evelyn, the problem is I have a broken leg. Whoa. Okay. Broken leg. Um, my ad advice to you is to, um, is just don't stress. Um, your leg will heal. It will heal. So, but when it's broken, you need to, um, not, not move your leg. <laughs> my advice to you, do not move your leg because it's broken. And that's serious. <laughs> okay, here we go. Last card. This is the advice right here. If I were you, I'd take some time off. If I were you, I'd take some time off. What's the problem? Yeah, Lolly, get rest. That's, so Lolly's advice to Evelyn, 
get rest. Helga, I'm dreaming about summertime. Okay, if I were you, I'd take some time off. Oh, Radu, have you broken any bones? Yes, my hand. I broke my hand and my nose. I've broken, I've broken my hand and nose. Oh, yeah. Let's see. That's great advice. Just upper body exercise would work for Evelyn. Yeah. Let's see. For sure, for sure. Oh, good, good, good. Thank you, Dr. Maris. I easily gain weight. Perfect, Dr. Maris. Oh, okay, Evelyn. Evelyn's problem is um, she's working too much. So my advice to you is if I were you, I'd take some time off. Evelyn, if I were you, I would take some time off. Evelyn, if I were you, I would take some time off. Tomas, if you are burned out, I advise you to take a day off. Good advice, Tomas. Good advice. Ava, I'm so busy. Uh-oh. Ava, my advice to you, um, if I were you, I'd take some time off. Oh, Lolly, I am overwhelmed now. Okay, so I am overwhelmed I am overwhelmed now. Okay, Lolly's problem is she feels overwhelmed by life. Okay, Lolly feels overwhelmed by life. So my advice to you is, if I were you, I'd take some time off, Lolly. If I were you, I would take some time off. Radu, I am stressed. I need some time off. Please. If I were you, Radu, I would take some time off. Oh, Samuel, the problem is I get too involved with work or I get too involved in work. Yeah, Lolly, I am overwhelmed by life. If I were you, I would take some time off. Samuel, um, if my advice to you, if I were you, I would take some time off. Good, 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 good. Okay, actually, you know what? I have a good idea, okay? In the chat, please write this in the chat, okay? So please write this in, and this will be um, good for you to study in the future, okay? So please, everyone in the chat, write, you ought to. So right now, you ought to, and then um, three points, ellipses, one, two, three, ellipses, okay? So um, dot, 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 okay? So in the chat right now, everyone write, you ought to dot, 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 okay? So here, everyone write this. You ought to dot, 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 okay? You ought to dot, dot, dot. So write that in the chat, please. You ought to dot, dot, dot. So this is for your um, studying in the future. You ought to dot, dot, dot. And then we just put different words in there. Okay, so everyone in the chat, please write that now. You ought to dot, dot, dot. Okay. Um, okay, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good, Lolly. Yeah, okay, good, Air Lady. Thank you. Okay, great, 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 great. Um, overwhelmed by life, that means you feel very um, heavy. Like life feels very heavy, a little depressed there, um, Tomas. Okay, so good. So you ought to dot, dot, dot. Oh, oh, I'd. Yeah, I would, I'd. Okay, so Lee has a pronunciation, um, a pronunciation question. Uh, I pronounce I'd, yes. If I were you, I'd. That's right. Evelyn, <laughs> love you. Mwah. Thank you. Hold, hold on, Evelyn. I, I'm answering Lee's question here. So yeah, so Lee, um, if I were you, I'd. 
which means I would. I would or I'd. I would, I'd, I'd. Okay, good question there, um, Lee. Evelyn, I love you, Evelyn. Thank you so much for that. Evelyn, you are now on the wall of love. Evelyn, on the wall of love, yes. Thank you so much, Evelyn. I really, really appreciate your kind support. You're a... Okay, Ev... Oh, hold on. Hold on, Evelyn. I didn't put the V. Hold on, I don't want to mispronounce or misspell your name. Okay, yes. The wall of love. Cheers, Evelyn. Love you. Mwah. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Thank you so much. Okay, everyone wrote. Everyone wrote. You ought to dot dot dot. Okay, next one. Next. Please write. One idea is to dot dot dot. Please write. One. One idea is to dot dot dot. Okay, everyone, please write that in the chat. One idea is to dot dot dot. One idea is to dot dot dot. Please write that in the chat. One idea is to dot dot dot. One idea is to dot dot dot. Thank you. Yes, Artie. Thank you. Thank you. One idea is to dot dot dot. Okay, these are all how to how to give advice how to one idea is to dot 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 okay yes air lady thank you okay our next please write this in the chat have you tried to have you or have you tried dot 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 have you tried dot 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 please write that in the chat thank you let's okay our next one have you tried dot dot dot? Have you tried dot dot dot? Have you tried dot dot dot? Please write that in the chat. Okay, our next one. It's a good idea too dot dot dot. It's a good idea too dot dot dot. It's a good idea too. 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 Please write that in the chat. It's a good idea too. Our next, the best thing to do is, the best thing to do is, the best thing to do is, please write that in the chat. The best thing to do is, the best thing to do is. Please write that in the chat. The best thing to do is, dot, dot, dot. The best thing to do is, the best thing to do is, the best thing to do is, please write that in the chat. Next one, in my experience, dot, dot, dot. In my experience, dot, dot, dot. In my experience, in my experience, in my experience, please write that in the chat. Next, I would advise you to, I would advise you to, write that in the chat, please. I would advise you to dot 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 I would advise you to dot 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 I would advise you to dot 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 I would advise you to please write that in the chat I would advise you to please write that in the chat okay one more if I were you I'd dot 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 if I were you comma I dot 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 if I were you comma I'd dot 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 if I were you comma I'd dot dot dot. If I were you, comma, I'd dot dot dot. If I were you, comma, I'd dot 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 dot. Okay, so those are how to give advice, right? That is how to give advice. And here are eight examples. Okay, so lots of ways to give advice, right? Lots of ways to do it, many, many ways to do it. And um, I hope that um, you will use these phrases, yeah? I hope you will use these phrases. You ought to blah, blah, blah. It's a good idea to blah, blah, blah. 
If I were you, I'd blah, blah, blah. Okay, so these are all wonderful ways to give advice. Yes, they are. Okay, good, 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 good. Now, um, let's, if I were you, if, if I were in your shoes, I would, yeah, so there are many, that's good, yes, yes, let's, very good, let's see, very good. Um, there are many, many ways how to give advice, right? So there are many, many ways, and um, in, in the chat, right, right now, many people are writing lots of great sentences, great ways to give advice, so please um, go back, check out the, the chat, please study the chat, lots of great, great um, vocabulary, lots of great sentences, lots of great phrases, and Ava likes the blah, blah, blah. <laughs> blah, blah meaning just put in your own words. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. All right, well, um, I told you we will um, come back to the sentence, or the, not the sentence, the conversation. Let's come back to that. And I wrote some things about minerals, yeah. So I learned a lot myself, right? And so what, what happens with when I plan these lessons is um, I think of a topic and I, I write, you know, I write a, I write a sample sentence or, or conversation. I write a, a, a sample conversation. And when, when I'm writing my sample or example conversations, I try to think of some like keywords and, and some key ideas, but other, but I don't think about everything I write about, right? And then, um, and then when I'm ready to present it, right? When I'm, when we're demonstrating the conversation, when we're going to practice the conversation, other ideas come to me. Like, oh, like I, I want to talk about, um, okay being tired. Oh, what, what should we do when we feel tired? Oh, take vitamins, take minerals. But then I don't really go deeper. But then when, I, when I'm ready to um, teach the conversation, then new ideas come to me. And so that's what happened with minerals. And by doing that, I'm learning too. Like, oh, I'm learning more about minerals. I'm learning more about vitamins as well because I'm researching these so I can, so I can um, help you, I could, so we can talk about it, right? So here are some important minerals, okay? Here are some important minerals. Important minerals. We have calcium. I think we know calcium, right? So calcium's a mineral and that helps our bones, right? That's calcium gives us strength in our bones. It, it builds bones. And I think we get calcium from like milk. Um, we get, you know, from milk and dairy, or we could say dairy, eggs. So let's just say dairy. So we, we get, um, oh, it should be AI, gosh, 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 gosh. Okay, so we get calcium from like dairy, right? And then uh, another important is potassium. Yeah, potassium. And what? What potassium does, it, it um, so, so potassium is like with salt, right? So when we eat salt, we, we get potassium from salt, and that helps our nerves, that helps our muscles, nerves and muscles, and we get um, potassium from, no, 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 not, not salt, so that's sodium, sorry, potassium, sorry, forget that, it's not, it's not salt. Sodium is salt. We're talking about potassium. And potassium helps our nerves and muscles. 
So, okay, I'm going to put calcium bones. And, and then potassium is good for our nerves and muscles. Okay, so potassium is good for our, our nerves and muscles. And we get potassium from bananas, fresh fruit, vegetables, yeah? So potassium is an important mineral. Also, another important mineral is sodium. And... Um, Sodium is, is good to retain water, so our body needs, needs um, water, and so, and so the, uh, the sodium um, maintains our water. So um, body water. Yeah. And then um, another magnesium. Magnesium is another important mineral. Magnesium. Magnesium. Uh, let me do a better M. Ah, ah. Okay, and magnesium is good for blood pressure. Blood pressure. Okay, magnesium is important for blood pressure. And we get magnesium from nuts, seeds, beans, grains, okay? So magnesium is good for our blood pressure. And then another important mineral is iron. And iron is good for our growth and development and our hemoglobin, red blood cells. And the red blood cells carries our oxygen. So, so the, um, let's just say iron is good for hemoglobin. Okay, I'm going to just say he, um, hemoglobin. Okay, hemoglobin, which is our red blood cells, red blood cells. And that, and that moves our oxygen, so that's good for our whole body, right? So, so we want the red blood cells to, to move the oxygen, and so um, iron is good for hemoglobin. And then the last one is zinc. Zinc. Zinc is, um, helps our immune system. Our immune. Oh, and then we get iron from, like, um, we get iron from fish and meat. So we get iron from fish and meat. And, okay, zinc helps our immune system. Immune system. So it helps our immune system. And that's, and then that helps us not get sick, right? So that immune system helps fight viruses, right? So if, we're, if our immune system is strong, we will um, not get sick. And so we need, we need zinc, right? And we get zinc from, um, uh, I didn't write that down. Or maybe like fish and meat. And, and then the, the zinc helps our, our cell division. And, and so, when one cell is compromised, then it makes another one, right? So, so our, our cells are always dividing, and so if one goes away, another one is produced. So, <laughs> all right, so these are important minerals. Calcium, potassium, sodium, magnesium, iron, zinc. And we, we get all this in, we call them superfoods, superfoods. Okay, so if you eat these foods, you will get calcium, 
potassium, sodium, magnesium, iron, zinc, okay? And these are the superfoods. Are you ready? Okay, meat. Yeah, so we want beef, chicken, fish, right? So meat, beef, chicken, and fish, okay? So we need meat is a superfood. Shellfish. Shellfish, that's, a, that's lobster, that's, um, those are crabs, those are shrimp, okay? So meat, shellfish, beans. beans, um, seeds, nuts, dairy, eggs, whole grains, Fruit, vegetables. Okay, everyone, this is what we should be eating all the time, yeah? So, please, if you eat meat, beans, seeds, nuts, dairy, dairy, milk, cheese, yogurt, right? Okay, dairy, shellfish. Eggs, um, whole grains, fruit and vegetables. You will stay healthy. You will get your important minerals. You will get important vitamins, yeah? So that's the way to do it, everyone. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Lolly's a nurse. She says, don't run out of zinc to fight against coronavirus. Yes, and then we get like um, vitamin D, right? And so um, please like get sunshine, please drink milk, please take vitamin D. That's going to help your immune system to fight the, um, zinc is C. Oh no, thank you, it's C. <laughs> oh no, Lolly, it's C. Sorry. Thank you, Lolly. Thank you, Lolly. Okay. Tang. Hello, Tang. Hello. Okay. Um, well, I'm looking at the clock. It's been two hours. Perfect timing. Two hours. Exactly. Well, before we go, I'm going to... Yeah, yeah. You're spamming, Tang. You just say hello once. That's good. Hello, Tang. Mwah. Thank you for coming, Tang. Yeah. Okay. Vitamin C. Yes, yes. Um, vitamin C, we get that in vegetables and fruit, right? We get vitamin C in fruit and vegetables. So basically, if you take all these, if you eat meat, right? Beef, chicken, fish. You eat beans. You eat seeds. You eat nuts. You eat dairy. If you eat shellfish, if you eat eggs, whole grains, fruit and vegetables, you are, you're covered. You are covered. You're doing... You're eating very well. Okay, so I'm gonna take a picture of the whiteboard. All right, so I'm gonna take a picture of the whiteboard and then I will post it today on my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice. So you can, maybe right now it's difficult for you to see, but if you go to my Facebook group page, you will be able to see it easily. Okay, so I'm gonna step behind the camera to take the picture. Okay, here we go. Let's count down. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. Okay, I got the picture. So I will upload this later today. Yes, I will. Hey, on. On, we're finished now. Oh, on, you came too late. Oh, no, on. <laughs> there you go, Radu. Um, but like, okay, for me this morning, for my breakfast, I had oatmeal, but in my oatmeal, I put a lot of these things in my oatmeal. So 
oatmeal is um, whole grains, right? So that's where oatmeal is, whole grains. So what I did is I put in blueberries. I put in my fruit. I put in blueberries. I also put in um, flaxseed, which is like a, um, it has bean products in there. I put um, seeds in there. I put nuts in there. I put milk in there, my dairy. I also put, um, yeah, so my, my oatmeal had lots of these in it. And so if you, when you make your lunch, when you make your breakfast, when you make your dinner, think about these things and you will be eating very healthy. Okay, let's see. What tents and structures can we use after weather or not pattern? Um, so like whether you do this or not. So whether you, let me think about this. Um, whether you take vitamins or eat the right foods, you will be healthy. So it, it's, we use the um, future. So future tense, will or going to. Or actually, will is better. So use the future will. So that's a good, so weather, meaning, so, okay, this is a good sentence. Thank you, uh, let's see. So let's use weather, and this will be our last. So, okay, whether you take vitamins or eat the right foods, you will stay healthy. Whether you take vitamins or eat the right foods, you will stay healthy. Ah, oh, thank you, Mrs. G. Mwah. Thank you again. So, okay, I have to go. It, it's, I've been here now over two hours. Wednesday's only one hour, but we did two hours. Wow, wow. Okay. Um, oh, let's see. You're, you're asking the questions at the end here. Can we say whether he will come or not? whether he is coming or not, whether um, he is going to come or not. Yeah, okay. Um, whether he comes or not, we're having the party. Whether he is coming or not, we will still have the party. Whether he is going to come or not, we will have the party. Yeah, same, same way. Good, no problem. Whether he will come or not, that's good. Whether he is coming or not, that works. Whether he is going to come or not, those all three work. Good, good, good. Yeah, would do something or not. Perfect, Tomas. Yeah. So again, the, the chat, you guys. So please, after we finish here today, the chat will be there. And so um, look at the chat and lots of good information. Yes, there is. Oh, Lolly, no problem. Um, as long as you guys are here and enjoy it, it's my pleasure. Yes, it is. Okay. All right, all right. Yeah, okay. So I want to give a big, today, a big th special thanks to Mrs. G Classroom and Evelyn for your extra kind support. Evelyn and Mrs. G are already on the green team, but they gave me extra support today. So I really appreciate it. Love you. Mwah. Thank you so much. And... Um, Everyone else, thank you for spending your valuable time here with me. I really appreciate that. And um, I will be back on Friday. So Friday, 10 a.m., that will be uh, March 5th. So I will be back here on March 5th. And on, please come earlier on. Please come on time on Friday, okay, on. And yes, thank you, Lolly. Lolly says, please join the green team, the friendly green team. So if you enjoy my content, if you enjoy my lessons, and you want your name to be green, like on, like Lolly, like Mrs. G, like Tomas, yes, like Evelyn, their names are green, they, they support me, they support the channel. So if you want to join the friendly green team, please join the channel. That would be um, a big help to me, and um, that would be great. Fantastic. I also, I want to say I have a new book too, 50 Very Short Conversations. This is book number three. It's like the other books, but of course, different conversations. Yeah. So, um, 
lots of English practice for you. Yeah, my videos and books. So, and I also have a website, markkulik.com, where you could download worksheets and flashcards that go with my videos. So, anyways, I will be back on Friday. Thanks so much, everyone. Love you. Mwah. And you guys are fantastic. Let's say goodbye together, shall we? Okay, let's count down and say goodbye together. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Thanks so much. Mwah. Thanks, everyone. I will see you next time. Take it easy. Bye. See you on Friday.